Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q2 of the bi weekly contest for Idris' uh, maximum score from removing substring. So, this one, to be honest, um, during the contest when I solved it, and you know, you could look at, watch me solve it during the contest, um, and you could hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord, and ask me more about this question. Um, to be honest, I don't have a great proof for this problem. Um, I just what I did during the contest was I looked at a few um, possible things, which is you know if you have B B B B B A A A A A or something like that. Well, in this case, you really have no choice which to go, and of course, if you have the opposite of that, you also have no choice, right? So the only time you have a choice is if you have you know B A B or B A B, and in this case, you always want to do greedy by removing the one that costs the most, um, and and because even if you have multiple, even if you have four, right here. Um, you either do BA and like if BA is more expensive then you do the BA and then you do the BA, right? If AB is more expensive, you do the AB and you still get the same, um, you get the same uh, uh, characters, right? So that's basically the idea that I have with respect to figuring out how to do greedy. I, I wasn't able to prove it, prove it um, like in a very definitive way, but, um, but that's basically the idea, right? Um, because like, for example, if you have someone like this, um, you know, if you could do BA or AB, it's going to give you the same answer. So, so if you if it, if you're going to get the same uh, answer um, on on the only choice that you have, then you might as well take the worst one. Um, I I got a wrong answer in this one because I I did I I was terrible and I um I did copy and paste. What I should have done was um probably refactor this but this is the code that i have in the contest so basically i will if x is greater than y meaning that it makes sense to do uh a and a then and b i basically just go through it and i remove all instances of a and then b by using a stack uh, add the score um if it's the other way around i also do it but you know doing the ba and then i add the sc uh, score y to the score and then at the very end i just go through it one more time to uh to to remove any remaining a b's that are left in you know whatever's possible um and yeah and that's basically the idea of just greedy and as you can see i did a lot of copy and pasting here which ultimately cost me five minutes in penalties um because for some reason the system like this test i guess it just i don't know it was good enough for that um so i got a wrong answer because i didn't write stack two in some of these because I copy and paste. Um, but yeah, so the, the solution here is just greedy. Um, you know, whatever is, gives you more more uh, value, do that first. And then after you do one pass of that, do another pass where you try to remove anything if possible. Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, and the reason why I kind of was let down this way during the contest was that... Um, I saw the length and it's n and n is really big so i knew that this was going to have to have a linear time solution and because of that um i kind of figured out it was greedy just by guessing because if it was not greedy and we need some way of doing uh more brute force it's going to be at least n square and that's just too slow right um so that, that was my guess um yeah that's all i have for this problem um and it, yeah in linear time because we do two scans and we use you know stacks so that it you know just goes for one of time uh so it's gonna be linear time in terms of space it's gonna be linear space because you know we have two two stacks linear space that's all i have for this problem let me know what you think and you can watch me solve it live during the contest next that's enough hmm. Any number of times. This feels like one of those greedy problems that is hard to prove.
That's really annoying. To poof this one. I wasn't confident about this one at all. I just don't know how to do it otherwise. Uh, okay. Thousand. Did I mix up the sounds? Oh, that's weird.
x is greater than y. <coughs> y is greater than x. Wait, how come this didn't happen? Oh, that's just silly. This is what happens when you copy and paste. I knew I should refactor this into a function. Still may be wrong, but maybe better. Hey, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, this was a rough contest um, for me, uh, just because I was being silly. Maybe I need more sleep. But yeah, hit the like button, the subscribe button, join me in Discord, and I will see y'all later. Bye-bye.